Oh, hello. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. Let me help you out. Give you a little hint. No hint. Perhaps you think you can piece things together from the clues you found yourself. Good luck with that. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go on, back to it. Speak soon. What the hell is wrong with you back there? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on, no. no, come on, that's ridiculous. What the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and... That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. I saw something. This, uh, uh, this old lady. I mean, she was batshit crazy and like dinosaur old. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... Let's time out, okay? This place is too fucked up to just be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, something is going on here. So what do we know for sure that we can all agree on? Did you see the gold? Anything? Manchurian gold isn't actually gold. It's a fucking chemical, and it's leaking all over Cargo Hold 2. I found this safety manual. It seemed to be geared at people who have to handle chemicals that can cause heart palpitations. What do you think actually happened to this place? Wish I knew. I saw 1947 on the newspaper. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, weird. And I don't like it. I was thinking I was gonna say this place is like one real bad trip, but then, I guess I just did already say that. Or wait, did I say it yet? <sighs> Crap. <laughs> Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? Like ghost ships are real and this is one and we're totally on it and oh, holy shit, we're so totally fucked. I guess that's one way to look at it. So according to this letter I found, the guards here were absolutely ter- We know more than we did before. That's something, at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I 
think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. Great. Could've used these if they weren't Swiss cheesed. Final way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. Pull you up. This is where I chased Conrad, before. Huh. I, I thought it looked familiar. Over here! Got a way through here. A radio yet? No, but there's gotta be a radio on this ship. There there has to be. I'm not exactly confident about our chances of survival. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey! Hey! Is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Over. Holy shit! We got him! Uh... If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. 
Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees, 30 minutes south, 151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please, get here now. We need help. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please, come in! Yo, guys, check it out. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I gotta be honest. I don't think I'm gonna make it down there in my shape. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the pitcher's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? Hey, if you're sure you're up for it, I believe you got it, bro. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect, big guy. I can handle this, trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. Okay, Julia, it's you and I. Bones? Everything still work? Everyone okay? We're okay. What are we gonna do? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Okay. We'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. After you. I'm guessing these are the lower levels of the ship. I wish I could actually, you know, enjoy this. What the hell are you talking about? any other circumstance, you know, this place would be the coolest place to explore, like, like ever. I'm gonna say no, not at all. Says the girl who couldn't wait to dive a wreck. Here, come check this out. 
Look, down there. Looks like the engine room. Good place to find a generator, right? The ladder's broken off here. I think I can just... Wait! Are you okay? Yeah, uh, all good. Just come down. What's up? That, it, 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 it was... Wait, wait, didn't you see it? Um, hello? Okay, so, I, so I'm seeing things, but you're not. Okay, so follow my thinking here. We know this ship is carrying Manchurian gold, which was actually some kind of dangerous chemical, right? And there's this, like, weird fog everywhere, all over the place. Maybe that's the Manchurian gold. And maybe it's fucking us all up, like in the head, you know? I mean... I definitely saw some crazy shit that I could have sworn was real, but maybe it wasn't. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. None of it happened. None of it was real. It was just a hallucination. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I mean, maybe there was a connection. Maybe they made contact. It's a theory, I guess. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. This. The ship was actually anchored. I wonder why. You know what I miss right now? Dry clothes? Yeah. Hey, hey, I found it! Oh, thank God. And it's working! Yep, this is it, all right. Just throw the switch and let's get back upstairs. Okay, let's get back upstairs. There's gotta be another way up. <laughs> we lost power, but we have it back. Can you hear me? Over! Please state your situation, over. We need help, now! There are things on the ship that are trying to hurt us. Over! Recovery mission is on route to your location. Over. Oh, come on, work, damn it! Look at this! The rebreather! The fisherman must have brought it over from the Duke of Milan. You think it still works? 
Looks like it's got a little juice left. Maybe a couple of minutes? Should we bring it with us? I mean, it's heavy. It's just gonna slow us down. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Dead weight. No. Je t'en prie. No. Je t'ai dit de la fermer, sale menteur. Ferme ta gueule de merde. Tu dis n'importe quoi. Tout ce que tu racontes, c'est des conneries. Alors, ferme ta sale gueule de merde. Écoute. Écoute-moi. Non. Fais pas ça. Ta gueule. Ah Je t'avais dit de fermer ta gueule. Oh fuck. I think we should try to avoid that. Yeah. Totally. I mean, these doors were meant to withstand all sorts of stuff. Did I? 
It's in you too, isn't it? Isn't it now? Ha! <laughs> Not again! It's all gone changing on me! What? What's changing? Stay away! Stay back from the mist! What? There's no mist, man! Don't breathe it! Don't breathe the mist! Why can't we breathe the mist? What does it do? It's life. Bringing things to life that shouldn't be alive. It's inside now. Inside with us, now. Please, just calm down. Stop! Stop! It's in one of us, isn't it? Put the gun down, now! Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you breathe in the mist! It's happening. I can feel it! Okay, all, all right, look. I, there was, you know, something back there. Uh, maybe a mist or a fog, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No, look, we held our breath. We did not breathe any of that stuff. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. You're holding your breath right now. Oh, God. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? It's in me, isn't it? Uh, uh, I can feel it swirling around in there. It's changing me. On the inside. No, no. I, 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 I can't see it. You're all right, man. There's no mist. Stop. Stop lying. You can all see it in me, can't you? You're all just lying, and the mist is inside. Keep me alive! Hey, man, come on, just put the. Wait by the radio. Why? I'm gonna check the next level. There might be some more gear down there we can use. Uh... I'm not going far. Just wait by the radio. I'm gonna hang back here as well. by the radio. We need someone to keep listening. Aye, aye, Cap. I saw the, the, the big guy. He had the distributor cap. You gotta go after him.
This must have been what we just heard. Oh no, what's that? Does it matter? We need that distributor cap. Here! He had to have come this way. I'm gonna make this jump, Alex. I'll have to find another way around. Get lucky. You rat fucker! Keep on coming, why don't you? Hey, it's okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fliss.
All right. Let's try it. that took our boat, that there was gold. He wanted the gold. That's all this was about. Venturian gold. Well, that turned out to be quite a bit different than we expected. You know, I just keep going over it and over it, and it doesn't make any sense, you know. I'm just, and I know what I saw. I just don't believe in whatever it was that I saw. I saw Alex. It wasn't Alex, it was someone else. But they looked just like Alex, and he was sneering at me. Fucking rich kids. So, um, does anybody else feel like knocking back Frosty? This guy. Yeah. 